When you return from space, I think it's different for every person and also differs a lot based on how long you were up in space. So our mission was 15 days. That was long enough to get pretty well adjusted. And when we got back, uh, I just remember that we rolled out on the runway at Kennedy Space Center. And when we came to a stop, it felt like to me the, the runway was pitching up and down about six feet like being on the ocean. And uh, so that was my first sensation. And then, of course, later when I got to uh, get up and, and try and walk, like you said, it felt like I had uh, gained 100 or 200 pounds, just felt very heavy. And um, anytime you moved your head, like if you tried to walk and look to the side, it disoriented you and you wanted to, it, it, your body basically just couldn't, couldn't handle it and I tend to fall over. So we walked around a lot like Frankenstein, sort of our heads fixed straight ahead and shuffling our feet instead of picking them up for the first uh, hour or two after the flight. Um, we actually, when we first get off, go into a trailer that pulls up to the shuttle and it gives us a chance to sit there and kind of uh, relax, get some water, um, and get changed into fresh clothes. And within just an hour, there's an amazing change. You, your body adapts very quickly. But um, we then got out of the trailer and got a chance to walk around the space shuttle and look at, at the vehicle. And still, again, at that point, uh, even just an hour or two hours after the flight, um, you're feeling a lot better, but you have to be careful uh, not to exacerbate your inner ear and what it is that gives you balance. Uh, so generally keeping your head focused straight ahead helps and you'll notice that with most of the astronauts after a mission uh, they're trying to just walk fairly straight um, i found that it took about three days before i felt pretty much completely back to normal and it just gradually the effects gradually uh, died off